between the two. Now that guard, you know that's a white man. Now if by definition, the cameras that you said, that was a white man. Alright, that's what we were we came into saying that real quick that uh, the nation is supposed to say amongst themselves, all 12 tribes, we're supposed to say amongst themselves, we're supposed to get to where we do business and all that. Right? What is the issue of, 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 of let's say, if you mix the races? What, what's the issue? What's the Tony outcome if we all come from one part, one source, one energy source? What is the issue? Yes, yes, yes. 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 Yes, to possess it and have cast out many nations before thee, the Hittites, and the Gergesites, and the Amorites, and the Canaanites, and the Perizzites, and the Hephites, and the Jebusites, seven nations greater than and greater and mightier than thou. Right, so these are the nations that were in Canaan, that were there to prove us by war. We had to overcome and take by war because of their wickedness, because, because of their sin. Right? So we can inherit the promise. And the Lord thy God shall deliver them before thee, and thou shalt and thou shalt smite them. I believe they destroy them. You smite them utterly destroy them. You know? Thou shalt make no covenant with them. Don't make any covenant or agreement with them, read. Nor show mercy unto them. Nor show mercy unto them. So are these days in particular because to be previously the Lord they had been the Neither. I can already feel it. Have knowledge of his own self, his own culture, those are those other nations that that's, a, that's kind of like irrelevant because you're going to master them anyway. The only way you can be mastered if they come with deceit, lies, and distort your thinking. Okay. Now, with the proper education in the thinking, you can read from a Bible which is man written, but man inspired, spiritually inspired, man written because they buy the gospel according the gospel according to James. Matthew, Mark, and Luke, and John is not the same Matthew, Mark, and Luke, and John that was in that period because those people were illiterate. It was the even the first wasn't even written to 500 years after the birth of Christ. Now, anyway, now, I'm not even going to go Because you can go I, to I, 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 I'm not going to let you go. I can't say what I would like to. We can go into the archaeology yeah. about that, but I need to really know why you think that Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John have somehow been hijacked. Just like, just like, because of anything. This is like a ball bill and towing today. That same Mark, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John wasn't, it wasn't literally to even know that type of knowledge. The Gospels wasn't even written because a lot of those people back then in, 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 in Jerusalem, in those areas, were illiterate. The only ones that was kind of literate was scribes, the wealthy. Like Paul. Paul was only literate because of the, what he was doing. Paul was almost like an attorney. Now Paul was also a, a, a attacker of, uh, of the apostles. After, after that Christ, he went against the apostles. He killed many apostles. I'm not, not, not sure. He killed, he killed many apostles. You know, brother, brother, but when you spit more blood, you know. I agree with you. I agree with you. I agree with you. I agree with you. Because, because Matthew, he was a text of the text. He ended up writing the book of Matthew. He was a physician. So this just can't be illiterate. Right? He even wrote the book of, he even wrote the book of Acts to his friend Theophilus. So I agree with you there. You sure, sure you have folks who are literate back then. It's like you do now. But, but I understand what I said. But I'm going to say what you said. Spiritually inspired. Spiritually inspired. Yes, man wrote it. But man wrote history too. Man wrote law books. Man wrote 
books about medicine. It wrote, it, wrote books about anatomy. So where does it right. stop? What is what I'm saying? What's what's that that right? Right? What's what is that? That's what we're trying to decipher. Well, I can I can right. bring up to disagree. And brothers, I gotta go now. But no, 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 no. I think I think probably have to go for other reasons. There's no disagreement. Oh, class at this point. You know, when you came up here before, you said that um, you knew ever since that you was little that you was an Israelite. That's good all the way up to a certain point. You know why? Because it's following the custom of the Israelites is knowing you are an Israelite. Just saying that you know and not doing any other custom, then that really defeats the purpose. Of that, my descendants, my descendants come from the Jewish heritage. You understand how 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 the Jews how we were hijacked by the Amorites and Canaanites. In the Israel, it's today's Jews. It's like today's Jews, the Hasidic Jews, hijacked the 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 original Jews. Okay, do you follow the custom? No. So how do you? This was a what? Well, what customs do you not follow? I'm saying, knowing that, I don't follow the customs of farmers. I don't read the Torah. I don't read the Torah. Not yet. Let me say that. Not yet. I'm still in the process, man, because I'm always searching for secret knowledge. You say that? It doesn't. It doesn't. The days of the Sabbath. The days of the Sabbath. That's a good question. That's in the Torah. Right. 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 I'm supposed to do Sabbath? Yeah. But I'm not the perfect individual that I'm going to sit up there and lie and say I do Sabbath if I don't. Respect it. So now my question is, I'm saying, so my question. I should be doing Sabbath. Okay. That's, that's, no. that's, that's honest. Like I respect that. So what do you do? As a Hebrew man, what do you do? As a Hebrew man, understanding my genealogy through history. Now what I'm saying, what I do deal with, what they're doing around these settings, I need to get to go. I want to make sure I at least answer that yeah. first question. Because you kind of went on a yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to make sure I deal with your first question. Then you can deal with that. We were on the seven. Okay. Uh, yeah, we we free. Neither shall thou make mar make marriages with them. Neither shall you make marriages with them as far as the Canaanite people. Thy daughter thou shalt not give unto his son. Nor his daughter shall thou take unto thy son. So it's not supposed to be a marriage between the children that's going to go into why. For they will turn away their son, thy son, from following me, that they may serve other gods. So will the anger of the Lord be kindled against you and destroy thee suddenly. So that's it. Now watch this. That's the answer. Islam. I just want to say, Islam. The teaching is that I would I, before I marry a, a, a non-believer, I have to marry a believer. This is that we all submit and all bow down to one God. It does. If, if, if they're following the Dean or the Sunni, that's one God. That's 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 one God. <laughs> what does God make a distinction? If everybody plays it. It's one source. Right, but not you know if, 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 if she bow down, down, if I bow down, she's going, she, she's abiding to me because I abide to the Lord. That's what she does. But but now, now you if I you're, that, you're, you're right. But now, what name? Fourteen and nine. So what name are we supposed to call? Well, but because here he's called, here he's called Allah. Here he's called Krishna. Here he's called Raha or Brahmi. Here he's called the Shinto. There's eight, nine, nine attributes. Attributes mean in one source. Once we start making distinctions, then we just split up God. God is one. Once you start, we, we can't split up. So he's so 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 one, he has one name, right? What, what, what name of like, like if, if, if your name is Thomas, okay, okay, I'm calling okay, you Stephen. Stephen. That's not that's not watch you. You're not Stephen. Watch you're Thomas, when I say attributes, right? man, I mean I mean I'm talking about things that characterize his existence. This is what his I'm saying. Existence. Now understand. You know what? Can I say something? Because you, you just no, what you're saying is on point because that's what his name means. When you go into his one name of the true, the original, his name means I, I didn't tell you his name here, but his name actually means he is. Or he exists. That's the meaning of his name. You just said it. If it's Yahweh, Elohim, 
Because this, 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 this day hasn't come yet, but I'm looking forward to that day because you got the right idea. If there's only one God, how come we got all these different ways to dress him up? Worship him this way. Eat food for him that day. But this way. But that way. Not only that, one name, right? As a woman, you get offended, right? Kid, your name is Susan, right? You have a guy you know for a while, he's like, yes, yeah, so I'm Donna. Um, who's Donna? Okay. My name isn't Donna. Okay. My name's Susan. Okay. Right? Why is Heavenly Father any different? For this concern, the names are characterized. It works the same way on the physical level, too, man. It, it comes from how it works on a higher level. We all reflect on what's above. Thank you. 